All right, we just got done with the radio show. Paul's sitting on the corner waiting for his wife to pick him up. He just sold his car, called me 20 minutes before the show begging to pick him up. I didn't have time, so he had to hitchhike. So now he's sitting on the corner like a bum. I'm going to throw some change at him like the bum he is. And he's doing his Neanderthal text. What's up, dude? Let's say hi to the camera. Are you homeless, sir? Want some change? <laughs> you want some change? <laughs> I think I have a spare, <laughs> a spare jacket. I think I have some, uh, see, here's some silver. Oh, come on, you can use that to get some food. Maybe some sneakers, a shirt, some soap to wash those hands. <laughs> I'm going to pick it up. I'm going to buy stuff. I know you are. Uh, I know the value of ten cents. When your girlfriend knows you're throwing away ten cents like this, you're gonna, it, it'll be it'll be in for you, buddy. That could have that could have been a McDonald's over Taco Bell. It'll be curtains for you, man. She'll be like, "Oh, you're just throwing away our money, huh?" Actually, she'll say, "You're throwing away our money. I mean, my money." Can I get a post-show uh, wrap-up about the show and how it went tonight, please? I think I think it was great with Jordan on the show. She did an incredible job. What we didn't tell you is the reason she was back on is she's interviewing for your position, <laughs> just in case things don't work out in the track world. What do you think her odds are of getting my position? Well, her career would have to go incredibly, incredibly bad, uh, and that's not going to happen, so slim to none. But, but mine's already incredibly bad, so... So that's why, that's why we're both here. It's, both it's, of our careers have tanked. <laughs> and you're still looking for another co-host to replace me? Is that what's going on? We just need somebody that's not going to be so temperamental, I think. True. Not so sensitive? Yeah. Not, not somebody that needs a hug every day. Hug me. Love me. Feed me. Care bears and flowers. Care bears. <laughs> and a hug once in a while wouldn't wouldn't kill wouldn't kill me, Paul. Wouldn't kill you either. <laughs> it might. It might. All right. Uh, if I if I find some more food in the back of the car, I'll, I'll stop back, drop off some foods. I hope you run nine cents <laughs> short of buying whatever you're gonna buy for <laughs> cash. Hey, I throw you at least seventeen cents. Well, you did. You threw me nine cents. You threw me five pennies and a nickel. No, ten. You give me ten cents. Look at that. Bye, Paul. <laughs> the great Paul Tarek, everybody.